Last round. Hopefully I don't get stubborn and replay the same ones over and Oh, there's only two. Yes, there's only two. Let it be a short one. Damn. We actually found it. The third temple. Didn't need no stupid page anyhow. Not with my holy guidance. <laughs> Bow before me, dumbass demons. I am your king. God's touch really changed you, White. You're starting to sound just like the believers. You're just jealous. Maybe a little. No sign of Violet, huh? Doesn't mean she isn't here. We should be prepared to fight. You don't think she's already run off with the book? Yeah. I'd imagine his grace would have pointed me elsewhere if that were the case. Good this lord. Is the culmination of our efforts. Daunting, isn't it? If I'm being completely honest, I can't help but feel a bit envious of all the other Neons. Just out there, completing their missions. Seems a lot easier than this crap. It makes sense to feel that way. We've been blindly following orders our whole lives. And now, we're taking control of our own destiny. Some of the writing in this is super cheesy. Oh wait. Shit. I gotta turn it around. Crap. Super weird. Inside. Okay. Another one down. I'm just gonna go next level because I already got gold. What is this place? It's horrible. Perfectly preserved massacre. Mm -hmm. You don't suppose these are all pieces of God, do you? Seems possible. It makes sense. That hand is enormous. And there's the voice of God. Did you hear that? Hear what? Show yourself! Right, look! That hand, it's opening. Something's floating down from inside it. He held the book. It was in his hand. Holy crap. This is it. No way, is it? <laughs> we found the book of life. Ah, uh, of course. Run! Hold on! I'm coming for you! Ah! Yay! I did it! I finally blew up that stupid red! Violet! <laughs> Violet? Ah! There you are, Mr. White. Thank goodness you came to bring me my book! Stupid hand wouldn't open for me no matter how many explosives I set off. It only opens for those it deems worthy. Believe me, I've tried many times before. Oh, Green wanted to find the book also. <laughs> Green! Green! Violet, what have I told you about playing rough with White? This traitor! All he talks about is how much he resents you! Never planning to share the book of life with you, even though you're our leader. But look! Now I've got the book, while White is squirming beneath my feet like a worm. He's kind of fucking it. smack you. You don't need him anymore with me by your side. What do you say I punish him for you? 
Then we can rule over heaven. Just the two of us. <sighs> <laughs> oh, Violet. So young. But already your mind's so wicked. You think you've proven yourself worthy, have you? My sweet, sweet girl. Even God himself denied you. Mm -hmm. I just have no intentions of losing my wife. Violet! You still cry out for her. Even now? It's not her fault that you poisoned her. You taint everything you put your hands on. <laughs> Perhaps you are right. You've always had such a soft heart, White. Only calloused when I made it so. But that's precisely why I predicted God's hand would open for you all along. Hmm. Hard to believe his clenched fist was all that shielded the book from the believers, and later from me. It's funny. I waited so many years for you to bring me this book, and despite all your kicking and screaming, I knew I could count on you in the end. Delusional. I didn't do crap for you. Oh, but you did. Try as you might, you can never untether yourself from me. Who do you think left you the page? Yeah. What How exactly should we get a page, here, by the way? <laughs> because if the hand wouldn't open, you couldn't get the book. So how'd you get the page? I wish not only to be freed from their control, but also from their hypocrisy and judgment. Red and I want the same. To restore heaven to what it once was. No, no. You misunderstand. Restoration is just a changing of the guard. We'd be leaving our judgment and That's where it's supposed to be. What exactly do you seek from God, boy? Forgiveness? A meaningless concept. Union with his holiness? Unlikely. What the hell do you know? You think we will be rewarded after all we've done? We are both past the point of redemption. We were set up to fail in a world of suffering that he created. We made our choices. God had nothing to do with it. Can't you see this? Hmm. Semi-religious philosophy. God cursed us to a meaningless existence and an even more meaningless afterlife. Yet, he sits upon his throne, writing our names in his book of forgiveness, as though that makes up for the pain we've endured. Has he ever once considered whether we forgive him? The believers could only kick God out of heaven with the book of death, but once I have both books at my disposal, I will annihilate it all. Mm. You think hating your own miserable existence gives you the right to destroy everyone else's? You see it as an act of destruction. I see it as an act of mercy. Huh. And you're no better than the believers. I'm not letting you leave here with that book. Oh. And just how do you plan to stop me? By doing something I should have done a long time ago. <laughs> you wish to duel. Well, who am I to deny you? Second boss fight? I won't tell Red if you don't. You won't be able to say a damn thing with my sword down your throat. Oh shit. Oh, 
shit. This is rougher than the last one. This is much rougher than the other ones. Shit.
fight's rough. It's over, Green. Yes! Lay the final blow upon me! Yes! Yes! The halo is destroyed! I am free at last! <laughs> you see, right. It's just as I say. You are so hardwired to aid me that you will do so without me even needing to ask. You put that goddamn halo in the path of my sword. I didn't do anything. Silly boy, don't be so humble. If I remember correctly, you were the one who chose to fight. Was you fucking killing everybody? Now the believers will. What be is this gaslighting? Take their beloved book of death and begin my own day of judgment. Of you wanted to help me, of course you wanted to help me, and no. that's why you want started a fight. What the fuck? <laughs> Once you come to your senses, why? You will. Half the credit is yours, after all. No! No! Get back here! I won't let you go! Bastard! Violet! Green! You ungrateful bastard! I won't lose! Pitiful fool. You've already lost. I have made my choice. <laughs> yeah. But you know what I realized? We both chose wrong. Oh! <coughs> she blew... The book blew up. Hmm. Not bad well, for that. a dead guy, huh? Yeah. Attention, Neons. We are in a state of emergency. Former champion Neon Green has been overcome by his sinful nature. He has stolen the Book of Death and has even gone so far as to murder my beloved comrade. The lives of many more believers are being lost to Green as we speak. He is destroying the sanctity of heaven! Uh, nice to know Green is enjoying himself. It is one completely intact book. Any Neon who slays Green and recovers our book will be awarded to... Uh, uh, no, uh, five years in heaven! Can't you just detonate his mask? Not without the Book of Death, you Oh, so you can't know. donate anyone's mask. What about God? Why can't he help? Unholy scum, open your eyes! There is only us! The Believers! What? What the hell are we even doing here, then? Screw this! The Believers can't control us anymore! Where, where are you going? You must eliminate Green! Are you not enticed by heavenly delights any longer? Well, why can't we just have heavenly delights wait, now? Wait! Don't go! Don't leave us alone to Because y'all don't have control over the Book of Death. You can't blow people up. I wish I could be more smug about these assholes getting their just desserts, but you know, this feels pointless now. Oh, there's another episode? I thought we were done after 10. Granted, Judgment Day hasn't actually hit yet. There's something at the cathedral? Oh, Violet. You got the last laugh, Violet. Hmm. Oh, what the hell happened here? Oh, hello, Mr. White. Green stormed the place a short while ago. I was out getting coffee, but I imagine it was quite terrifying. 
And you're still gonna stay here and work? Where else would I go? I'm the receptionist. In that case, is Mikey busy? Now, Mr. White, we both know the answer to that question has never once concerned you. Yeah, but it's my last day here. I figured I'd pretend. <laughs> Go on ahead, Mr. White. Mr. Mikey is waiting for you. Oh, I still got a Heavenly Delight ticket. Where the hell have you been? I, I filled Mikey in on everything I knew, but I didn't see what happened after the explosion. Violet didn't make it. She destroyed the book, too. Sorry. I was just at the sermon. I just needed a second to collect my thoughts. You think I ain't got concerns, kid? This is the second day in a row I had to patch up one of you jokers. Mm. Speaking of which, you holding up okay, Red? It'll be a bit before I can fight again, but hey, I'm not dead. <laughs> At this point, no explosion is big enough to do you in. They're not a reliable way to kill me. Are you two even listening to me? Yeah, <laughs> like just freaking out. <laughs> Listen, Violet may have bought you some time from grief, but while he's distracted with the Book of Death. The pages of the Book of Life are still scattered out there, and the freaking Hour of Judgment is upon us. So if you want to stand a chance of success, then you better haul your ass out the door and collect those pages. Stand. I said haul your punk ass. What's the point? There's no way I can collect them in time, especially if Red's staying behind. Don't be like that, White. Apparently Raz has some sort of tonic that will speed up my recovery. You can't carry us until then? No, actually, I can't. Have you not seen what happens when it's just me out there making decisions? I lost yellow. I lost violet. I somehow made green stronger. Hey, pull yourself together. Of all the stinking neons out there, the big guy chose you to entrust with his book. Well, he picked the wrong guy. I can direct my rage at green all I want. But when all's said and done, I'm just as much at fault for the death of our teammates. Not just in life, but here too. And what, I, I'm just supposed to ignore that? Because God gave me a book that I instantly lost? Green was right. I mean, how can I ever even hope to be redeemed when I'll always be his puppet through and through? Someone smack him out of it. done yet? Thank you. Because frankly, I'm sick of your pity party. Thank you. you know how many years I participated in the Days of Judgment before you came along? The first few times I woke up at the Glass Ocean, all I could think about was how painful it'd be to see you again. My heart was heavy with resentment toward you, and it only got heavier, year after year. But still, you never... This was the first year I saw you. My feelings were boiling over as I watched you float to the surface of the Glass Ocean. But then, all of a sudden, you stopped, and you started to sink. Without even thinking, I grabbed your hand. And in that instant, I let everything go. I pulled you out of the water. And when I looked at your stupid face, I found it so silly. All that time I'd spent agonizing over the past. I... I forgave you, White. So please, won't you forgive yourself? Huh? This is a page from the Book of Life. Do the right thing. What? A soul card? It's gotta be insanely overpowered considering the source. But what can it do? Whoa, Mikey! How'd you get over there so fast? Kid, you just freaking teleported! No Ooh. way! Really? <laughs> Holy crap! I bet that's not the only thing that card can do. <laughs> then I... <laughs> yes! There's the white we all know and love. We're gonna get all those pages in no time. We? Yes, we. I'm not about to let you hog all the action. Besides, I clearly ain't seen any neons today. <laughs> Fine. I guess you can tag along. Hey, Mikey! Yes! Gabby, take over for me. I'm heading out. 
Is this a promotion, sir? It's whatever you want it to be, babe. Yay! I also thought this would be over. Must be nice getting out of the office to survey your old haunts, huh, Mikey? Yeah, sort of. They're all different now, though. What did heaven used to be like? Heaven. I might actually have to call That's it for a bit and eat dinner. Call it. The locals know it as Sheol. It wasn't much to write home about, but there used to be way more ain't They're really missing, you know? What happened to them? What do you mean, what happened to them? <laughs> Part of the calling. By the believers. Yeah. Ooh, crap. Nah, it's all right. Honestly, the worst part of all this is seeing me on damn masks. What's wrong with these masks? I actually always thought they were <laughs> kind of cool. They're fashioned from the carcasses of dead angels, dingus. Uh, okay. How was I supposed to know that? Only angels have the power of holy flame. When those masks are detonated. That flame is what disintegrates you. Seeing you all running around in those masks year after year. It's like being haunted by my mates. Damn. That's gotta be rough. You wouldn't think it, but I was always the runt of my group. I watched so many more capable angels bite the dust in the war. Didn't feel like I had any other options aside from swearing allegiance to the believers. I regret it, though. Dying with my mates would have been a lot better than living. But you know how it goes. Mistakes were made. No use dwelling on them, right? Yeah. Hey, if I die with you here, it'll make up for my cowardice back then. You're not gonna die, Mikey. Not if you're worth your salt. Okay, yeah, I think I'm going to return to hub. Yeah, I need to stop and eat dinner. I realize, and I don't know how much, it says one date of judgment, so I may pop this in for a mini stream. Tonight? Tomorrow, maybe? Sometime? I've already streamed for six hours. Yeah, I need to stop. <laughs> it's time to stop. Time to walk away for a little bit and take a break. Anyway, see you soon. I will be back to this in another sort of mini round. Bye-bye. This is nine, ten, almost done. So, where are we headed? Hmm, looks like the page glows.